Hi, my name is Sam Dhanishekaran and welcome to this uh, database lessons series. In this video, we will talk about what is a foreign key. So, in the previous videos, we uh, talked about this popular nursery rhyme. Old MacDonald had a farm, e -I -E -I -O. So, let's just assume uh, Mr. MacDonald from that uh, rhyme starts a business. He calls it uh, EIEIO, Inc. I hope there isn't a real EIEIO ink and I'm not infringing anyone's data, so uh, anyone's rights. So uh, this is just a fictional company. Okay, so he wants to produce goods and uh, sell. So to do that, he takes a list of what are the things he can produce. So he uh, takes a, a list of products okay so so he can sell uh, cow milk chicken egg chicken apple mango duck egg orange okay so he produces these things and then uh, he uh, displays them in a uh, shop near his farm and then uh, he, he sells them Okay, he helps, he hires a, a salesman or a sales girl, and then each and every day, uh, you know, they who whoever sell the thing, they need to show him what they have sold. Okay, so on the first day, the sales person shows this this thing, right? That you know, this is the day, all right. October 20th on 2012 10 gallons of cow milk has been sold 200 chicken eggs and 50 duck eggs okay he's selling duck eggs too okay and the 250 orange okay so Mr. McDonald is so happy because you know uh, he sold like 10 gallons of uh, cow milk and uh, some chicken eggs and uh, duck eggs and uh, orange so he hasn't sold chicken apple banana but that's fine okay so at least businesses he business is picking up okay so the next day okay he looks at the the ledger uh, the, the, say the sales uh, document and then you know so uh, 21st okay this is 21st apple cool he has apple he sold apple mango 380 and now he wonders, huh, where is mango? There is no mango, right? Then how come the, the salesperson listed that he has, he had sold 380 mangoes? This is not correct. And then he scans down cow milk, chicken milk, dinosaur egg. Wow. He doesn't produce dinosaur egg and... Uh, he doesn't think anybody in the world produces dinosaur egg. So, definitely something wrong with this data, right? So, this could be a mistake and this could be a mistake. Instead of entering some value, the salesperson had entered a wrong value. So, this entire data is wrong. How can he avoid that? Because he doesn't produce mango right these are the products so he they can sell only whatever products which he has he didn't produce mango and he didn't definitely produce dinosaur yet so what happened so he needs to find a way where his sales people when they enter the data they don't make a mistake so what can he do this in the in, in the system database system <clears throat> he maintains he can implement something called foreign key what is a foreign key right let's just take the example first let's just analyze the example and then uh, I'll explain what is a foreign key because when I learned database years ago they gave me the definition of foreign key and the example next and I was totally confused it took me a couple of days for me to understand and uh, 
yeah i wasn't uh, or maybe i am still not bright either but i don't know anyway uh, so let, let let me take the example like now so i have this table product and then i have this table sales sales is the table where you know we maintain the daily sales and uh, it has to be designed in such a way that this particular column this name column right which is the uh, i which are the item being sold the values in that column should be a subset of the values in this column meaning that in real world they can sell only what is being produced they cannot sell something which is not listed here so how do we make sure that people doesn't enter a wrong value here you implement a foreign key and you say this foreign key refers to this data meaning that the values in this column they refer the values in this column and they should be a subset of or they should be uh, 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 anything which is already present here okay they cannot be uh, anything which isn't present here but they could be anything which is present here okay so that is what foreign key is it if with this foreign key with this uh, uh, structure enabled if someone comes and types dinosaur egg here right it wouldn't allow the database system won't allow it will say like no uh, violation foreign key violation so what is a foreign key uh, the values in a column uh, the, the the features of the uh, foreign key the values in a column should be a subset of the value in another column so that is maintained by the foreign key foreign key implements that rule it cannot have any other value so in this case this table sales and this column so i refer like you no know, table name dot this column sales dot name is referencing this product dot name okay and by virtue of that you know in the database world we can call sales table as a child table to the parent to the product table which is which would be a parent table meaning that uh, this has to have the data before this has to have the data and the data here complies with the data here it's as simple as that so with this setup the 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 sales person uh now uh, they cannot really make any mistake so this is what a foreign key is a foreign key is something that you know uh, implements a, a rule uh, basically saying that a particular set of data has to be a subset of other data okay so if you see there is some kind of relation in it and i'll talk about this word relation in the next video thanks for watching and if you have any questions please send me your comments